gold. Oh, tronic bridges. Sorry, matrices. Oh, oh, lovely. What the? Hello, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and welcome back to Let's Play Reforged Eden. I'm Seven Foot Dust Bunny, and we're still at the abandoned bunker where you may remember I broke into this room and uh, flicked this switch. But there was a wardrobe here, and there's a ladder behind it. And the ladder actually goes all the way around to here, which is where I should have gone up. And there is indeed a loot container up here I missed, which I just thought I would mention. Um, see, it comes out here. Um, for those who might have thought I missed it, but while I'm taking apart everything, I have found it. So, just to let you know where it is, and how to get to it, and what was in it. Okay, and stepping forward in this room, which was the room we came into, where there was a Xerax guy, a land claim device, there is a switch on the ceiling, and it can often be useful to have a look at what this does. Well, this was the shock weaver, so this switch, I believe, would have turned off the turret up there, that took me so much effort to destroy so every time you learn something new so large reinforced container oh mutated substance okay is that worth something I don't know I mean I'm taking the basic CPU extender for sure and I guess we're taking that container but um other than that, I, I hear a spider we do scorpion thing wandering about somewhere, but I haven't seen it. But otherwise, I think I've gone around and grabbed everything I can find. I just wanted to show you those bits before we get into the crux of this episode, because I thought a few people might have mentioned it in the comments, and it turns out that I picked them up off screen. So, in a genius move, I was flying down here and uh, we saw like I don't know if it's an unknown artifact the heat signature down here and we also saw this pirate signature here so we decided to come have a look at this which you've all missed because I forgot to um, press record as I was flying this we were just over here somewhere is where the base was I don't know why it's disappeared off the map but it has. So the abandoned um, depot was somewhere around here somewhere. And yeah, we came along here and it saw it was just a Nina, but there was another heat signature just here, which turned out to be, he says, as I'm here, an abandoned drone base. And yes, I was just literally about to check if there were any hidden gun turrets here because I don't like gun turrets and I wanted to make sure I got rid of any gun turrets before I got in there and got my ass handed to me so I'm assuming there's probably a one around here as well yep there we go and I just wanted to come in and sort of make sure the area was vaguely safe before I go in and get my face blown off because we seem to have a lot of abandoned bases on this planet and I, for one, am loving it because we're getting a lot of little ships and stuff. Well, we're getting a lot of stuff. Yes, and I thought you might. There's some spawn there. Hello. You can't see them very well. You glow in the dark, though. Hello. Yep. Don't mind if I do. Please die. Thank you. So yeah, there's a lot of these little abandoned bases, but many of these have really good stuff, as many of you said they would. So this all seems excellent to me. So we're definitely going in here. Did yeah, I turn the thrusters off on the main ship? 
but I'm expecting this to be quite the base because this is quite the base normally so whether it's the same or whether it's different I don't know um, what do we got here let's start chucking stuff in a dump box I might actually just move the Icarus up closer because ideally I would like to remain connected to the Icarus most of the way through the base I mean there's no guarantees but it would be good oh and there's one other thing I wanted to talk about just before we get into the base proper and that is I think I now have enough stuff to actually start bringing it to, to bring in my little SV I've been working on which is the soul piercer here so it, you can't see much of it here but I am going to be starting to load this up and get all get all this in because we need 40 small optronic bridges now I'm not sure I actually have that many but I already used some to make some advanced cores which I've got but if I don't have to use those advanced cores, I will keep them in my pocket. And I think I may... I have 48 already. So, yeah. I I have the ability to make some serious... Um, some serious ship there. The only other thing that, that questions me is whether or not one of the other ones I actually looked at, which which didn't require ox cores um, whether I go for that instead because I think that one was almost more maneuverable but it needed upgrade kits yes we're cold we're cold that's all right we're just gonna grab these bits then we're gonna go move the Icarus to which we'll warm up and then we'll actually go inside but you know there's a loot container here which must be looted and we are Oh, uh, wait. Only in range of the short hop. You see, yeah, this is why I wanted to get the Icarus over to be a bit closer. Because we're going to be limited on our storage otherwise. So I'm going to go bring the Icarus over and plonk it like dead close. And then we'll go in proper. Okay, so the Icarus is like butted right up against it here. And. I think we are good to go in now. So I guess we get in and start getting on with this drone base. Oh, hello. Sorry, didn't see you there, my friend. And we can hook back up the dump box, can't we? So let's um let's do that. Ooh, we're a little bit weird here. Let's do it as if we're doing it properly and get it hooked up correctly. Um, ooh, the ship is shooting something. Let's line up the dump box there. Thank you. And spiky mushroom. I mean, we might have to move some of these bits to stop them perishing. But some one of the gun turrets from somewhere was getting rid of something. Not quite sure what. Okay. So normally on the original drone base you have to go up and yes there's bad guys like here. Yes, hello. Yep, thank, thank you for playing. Now the one thing that worries me is in the original one there is gun turrets as well and the gun turrets in Reforged are far less friendly than the gun turrets in Vanilla. So, yeah, I'm actually loving this assault rifle. Loving this, and I do still love the pistol. The pistol is pretty awesome, too. I'll be honest. Whoa, 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 whoa. On my head? Do not like on my head. Um, yeah, do not like on the head. It freaks me out. 
Okay. I've, the red here makes me think gun turret constantly. And scares the crap out of me. Right, let's have a look. Loot container. Ooh, rounds. There's rounds at least. Rounds for the assault rifle. So I won't need to make any of those, that's for sure. Right, gun turret. Yes, you see? Yeah, don't like the gun turrets. And I know there are some here. Hello! Any more? Mm, nope. Okay. Uh, okay, there we go. Let's grab those bits and we'll do a quick um, dump into the fridge a second. Okay, and we'll go back to dump box. And also, just in this mode, I would like to switch things around and make sure I'm linked to the dump box. Like that. So then I will also get a warning if I'm getting out of range. Okay. Let's go down to the next level. Where. Okay. Nothing. Loot to distract you. Yes, from these little shits. Hate them. Hate them. Hate them. Hate them. Hate them. Hate them. And, okay, clear. And just checking the air is clear. There should be a couple. Oh, oh God. Oh, crap. Okay, not a fan of that. Um, yeah, I don't remember that in the past being there. Don't remember that block being there. But yeah, previously there's an elevator on either side which you can go through to come down either into this room or a different one. Hello, that's a lot of aluminium ore right there. Okay, yeah, I think it can't bring you down into this other room here. But we seem to be relatively good um, at the moment. Says, I mean, we could do with some additional rounds, but that's all right because he says we're collecting additional rounds. So there we go. Additional rounds are us. Oh, hello. Whoa, 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 whoa. Bloody, bloody gassing gun turrets. Oh, hello. Sorry, I didn't see you there. I am going to go back up, though, because we've got the other base. And oh my god, we're at 17 rats. That's ridiculous. Okay, we've got some various food. We'll probably eat some of that. I'll take those. More aluminium ore. Wow, we've got lots of ore now. few bits. O2. Ah yes, this one. Oh, a new heavy armor. That might come in handy. Clips and food. And did we take this one? Yep. Okay. And down this side, there's a couple of bits in there. But I'm not going to worry about that too much. And this one is the other room. Okay, we've got another loot container here, which has Hacking software overclock. No idea what that is. And no idea what the other thing was. Sorry, something seems to be stepping, so a little bit worried there. Whatever that is. Base factory construction unit. I'm guessing that's like a trade item worth 50,000 on the market, so yeah. I'm guessing that's more of a trade item. Okay, some more pentaxid. Multi tool bits. Right, we should be. A, I'm assuming these two rooms join each other essentially. Because they did in the original POI. 
I'm sure. I'm sure they did. And so this is oh hello. Okay. Thank you. Let's get rid of that. I'm gonna hit a bandage up right there. Just for a second. I can't access the fuel tanks as they are. The question is which way do we go from here? Because there appears to be a doorway here. And that is highly radioactive right there. So I'm just wondering if there's another way around. Because normally this goes out into a corridor. Yeah, and that's where you can join up with the other side. Because if we go through here, on this side, should be the room I was in before. Yeah, here we go. This is where I was before. And this room. Oh, hello. Sorry, needed to hide there because there's a gun turret right here. Go on. Yes, thank you. Right. And. Oh, hello. Nice of you to come. I'm assuming then. That's taking us into hello. Yeah, I saw you. I can't hit you, but I saw you. And this is where I blow myself up now. Did I get it? No, really? Fine, fine. Thank you. Let's go slightly more accurate. I'm worried I'm blowing up. I mean, these aren't big generators, so they're not too worth it. But I'm worried I'm blowing up like a hidden loot container or something that's back here. Hidden behind all of these. That one's not got a gun turret, but more generators. I mean, to be honest, if I had a deconstructor, it would be worth just getting all these bits for deconstruction purposes. Because, you know, they're quite valuable for deconstruction purposes. Okay, let's get ready to go down to the next level where, which sounds delightful. Right. Okay, you're down. More. Yeah. Whoa. Hello. Do you mind? Thank you. Um, I'm going to reload a second. Oh, yeah, bloody gun turrets. My least favourite thing in the game. Ow. Rinse the frickin' armour. This is the kind of time where I'm like, right, what I need to do is go over to the food box here. We've got tons of these. We've not got much of this. Hopefully we've got some more here. It's not a 28, that's not vast. But, I say right, make me all the bandages you can for now. Because, honestly, it's better than using the emergency heal things. And they give you a hundred. So they're pretty decent. Ah! Of course, there's a bloody turret above my head. Of course there is. Really? Okay, fine. Let's do it this way. Really? Oh, I can't get... I can't get... The... I didn't even manage to take that on. I'm already almost bloody dead. Why aren't you... Getting on... Deal with it. Oh, hello. Oh, really? Really? 
Now you give me bloody endoparasite, you <laughs> bastards. Uh, we've got an endoparasite tablet here. I'll do it. It is endoparasite, isn't it? Uh, have, oh, infected wound. Sorry. My apologies. Infected wound. <gasps> Any chances? Oh, we have a winner. 25% infected wound healing time. Right. Did I get rid of you? Yes, I did. Now I feel better. Right. <sighs> Let's have those bandages. And if you don't mind... Ah! Whoa, 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 whoa. Don't you start that shit. Don't you start that. Right. Where are some more of those bandages? At least five bandages there. I'll <sighs> take some more. Thank you. Right, uh, I'm guessing, I, I was wondering if I wouldn't be able to get into that until later. Right. Anything else here? There is a switched, which I'm going to switch it, even though I don't remember if this is a good switched or bad switched. There used to be a vent here, I, I thought, in the original you could go through. Or is that in the next room? It's been a while. I always love these, the donuts. These are cool. Ah, I see you. Yes. And... What the hell is that? Oh no, that's just... I think that's just like damage block piping. I wonder what it was then. But I'm sure there's a gun around here somewhere waiting to pop me off. Another bloody gun turret somewhere. I really hate the sodding gun turrets. Ah! Loot container! But be careful. Every time you see a loot container, think it's here to distract me from this. It's here to distract me from something about to shoot me in the face. Right, and there, and that's where I'm then going down over here. So let's. No, you don't. No, you don't. I was ready for you, you blowing up block. Right. Gold. Oh, tronic. Bridges. Sorry, matrices. Oh. Oh. Lovely. What the? What the? What the? Where did that shoot me from? I swear that was just shooting me through the wall. Oh no, no, no. It, I must have triggered. You scumbag bastards. It triggered a bloody sensor that brings a gun turret out behind you. Oh, that's just evil. Who added that? I'm sure that wasn't there before. Okay. That was uncalled for. Um, I have a dermal burn, I'm going to say. Yes, I do. <sighs> Let's uh, sort the dermal burn out now. Can I just uh, put... Uh, oh, no, I don't want to put that there, do I? Dermal burn. This one. <sighs> right. What food? Let's put that you know what I wouldn't mind making as well? is a couple more of these. I should have the bits for them. I mean, herbal leaves. Oh, ow, ow, ow. Come on. That's, that's uncalled for. All right. Really? Did something still manage to hit me? Okay, let's manage to knock down some of these, at least. Come on, you scumbags. Ah! I feel like I'm hitting something, but I don't see where. Okay, we need to move. Alright, that's lowered the numbers slightly. 
It's the little guys. The little guys I don't like. They're so hard to hit. Ow. God damn them. The little guys are just evil to hit. Right. <laughs> there goes another bandage. This is why the bandages are so useful, though. Oh, hello. Whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't see them until it was almost too late. Those guys are nasty. Go away, Nix the Scorpion. This is another similar setup to before, isn't it? Hello! Overseers are actually less scary again than these infected things. Hello, Overseer. Right, do you mind if I reload? Because... There's bound to be something nasty there. Hey, they're not supposed to be able to get through that gap. They seem to have made them capable of passing through blocks. I mean, what would be really cool is if they had some funky animation for them sort of scrunching up and climbing freakily through the hole. I think that would freak people out. It would also be awesome. Okay, that's a not allowed. So I can't go in this way. Yeah, I've been in this way. This is a not allowed. Did I miss a switch? I hit a switch before. But I almost feel like I've missed another switch. I mean, we've been in here. And we've been down here. But we didn't check these doors. I was assuming these are not allowed. They are not allowed. I feel like I've missed a switch. Yeah, I feel very much like I've missed a switch or something here. Okay, let me have a look around. Okay, so if I've missed a switch or something, I have absolutely no idea where. Because I just can't find anything that indicates a switch. Or anything like that. I mean, this is not allowed. This is open, okay. And this I can't get through. Question. Is this damaged? No. So I probably can't even blow that up, even if I wanted to. I'm pretty sure. Oh no, I can. So I'm going to blow it up. Because I cannot find a way through. Is that actually working? Probably not. Let's go back to this one. Because, yeah, I cannot... Really? I'm sure that had less hit points than that a second ago. Can't damage the structure with that. Says this one. Says I can't damage with it. So let's slap one of these on. Let's get this out and see what that does to it. Right, that blew it up. Oh crap! Okay. That hurt. Okay. I mean, at least I went out and topped up with oxygen health and all the all the general goodies um, before I came back in because that seemed like a good idea and I'm gonna suggest it probably was am I gonna be able to blow this up yes I am okay so this takes me into another room where I blew up a turret which had a light on it and I found a a nice loot container but this doesn't feel like this was how this was supposed to go. I feel like I'm doing something wrong. Because again, this is... This still says not allowed. 
and I'm gonna guess this other one isn't open either. Is it? He says. Not loud, not loud. So, not quite sure what's going on. Again, I'm gonna try and check further to see if I'm missing something, but um, it seems a bit strange at the moment. Plus, I'm almost out of plasma cannon rounds, which is a bit sad because this thing's been quite useful. But I feel like, you know, is there something, so, something here that's supposed to do something? I don't know. Right. Aha! That definitely did something. Standing in that square, lighting that block up, that did something. Okay. That, that had an effect. Yep, that had an effect. Uh -oh. Ah! Excuse me. Back this way. Go on. Thank you. Right now we'll reload. Yeah, that definitely had an effect. Let's uh, reload generally here. Okay, so that at least solved that mystery. Though I I still feel like that prob that wasn't really the way to do it. I don't know if I missed something. Let me know in the comments if I did. Oh, hello. Yes, you guys hurt like hell. Yeah, and... Hello! Hello! Oh, they just keep coming. Um, uh-oh. Yes. Hold, 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 fire. Hold, hold. Yes. Ah! Okay. Hello. Oh, Overseer. You guys don't actually scare me that much. Oddly. Supposed to be the big scaries, but you're not as big scary as you think. These guys are more big scary. I'm much gladder to shoot them. Because they are much bigger and scarier than the Overseer is. Hello! Perfect timing for me to reload. Thank you, sir. Uh, any more for any more? Let's just turn that heat signature off so I don't have to look at it. Oh, hello! Didn't see you there, fella. And you appear apparently have a buddy stood up here as well. Just waiting to sneak up on me. Oh, there's more than one of you. You sneaky little so-and-sos. But thank you for drawing my attention to these delicious looking alien loot containers. Because they are good stuff. Alright, I'm just going to go and loot these guys before they disappear. Because I do like to have their sandwiches. I'm not going to get you. Okay. And you have... Another epic plasma rifle, okay, and some auto mining cores and I think Ooh, large optronic matrix five off lovely energy pulse rifle. Hello. Though you don't actually seem to be ammo laser rifle charge, so you basically replace my laser rifle. But you you're only doing as much damage as Ah, so you do as much damage as this one does, but you fire a lot faster. Okay, sounds good. Let's give you a go. Because energy pulse laser rifle sounds fun. Apart from my lack of laser charges, which I sh probably should have some kicking around. Here, let's have a sandwich while we wait. Um... Those aren't perishable. No. So let's um 
Put those in there because none of those are perishable. I believe we can eat the sandwiches. Chuck those in. But we should have some more laser rounds kicking around here and probably in the ammo controller. Oh, only five. That's disappointing. Okay. We might have to actually try and make some. Because 51 probably isn't going to get us very far. Oh, I was thinking if I stood here, if I up. I would be able to operate this. I mean that's a little bit disappointing. I was assuming I was going to be able to operate this and then... Ah! There's a switch on the back. Okay. Holy crap! Huh. Not yet, not yet. Back, 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 back. Okay. Yeah, that was that was core gone. Something blown up there. I, I, I felt the core disappeared there. That that seemed to do the trick. Not quite sure where all those guys came from. But fortunately it was the perfect time for the uh for that loot to have come along because that was very handy for completing that. So, we're out of power, so we look very much like we're done. I mean, I'm going to be a little bit safe as I walk around here, just to see, because I still hear bad things, you see? Like last time, I still hear bad things all hiding around. Okay. Uh, you, you're just there to a black wall. Fair enough. And here. Ain't part of me, part of me, wants to for sure take that out. Just because I, that looks like the kind of place they would hide. A loot container of some description. But apparently not. Oh my god, now, now I shall forever remain trapped in that hole. Okay. Right. Let's get the salvage core. And w I'm going to put that down a bit further up. But then I can examine what it has. I mean, obviously I want to take the blast door blocks and things like that because they'll be awesome to take. Hello. Oh, I'm guessing this might have been where... Because that's where that engine was earlier. So seriously, if I'd blown up the end... Because... Right. When I was up here earlier and looking around again, this one blew out and there was an engine down here. I blew up and I blew up the grate that was on top of it to check it was an engine. So if I blown up the engine, could I have theoretically got down to the core? And then possibly, possibly, he says possibly, taken what I assume must have been some extenders and the like, which were in here? Maybe, possibly? Question mark? I wonder if you could do that a different way to do that. Alright, let's stick the salvage core down and let's see if there's anything worth taking still here right sensors fine o2 tanks and fuel obviously we're going to grab any of that we can get which will be i'm hoping a reasonable amount yes it will be i mean that's keeping us well fueled I mean, there's all these ammo boxes and that. I'm pretty sure I've looted most of these anyway. Let's randomly pick out a few to see if there's anything in them. No. So, was there anything else? NPC spawner, don't really care. Medical device, don't really care. So, on top of that, blast, blo blah, blast, blast, blow blocks. So blast door blocks we're going to take, the fuel tanks we'll take, 
those I'm not worried about. Equipment. Advanced system console. Does that do anything? This device is not functional yet. Okay. I'm, I don't know what it does. I might take it. Just because I don't know what it does. There's not a lot else, sadly. I mean, to be fair, we had our our lump of loot. So let's go and grab those bits I want. I think that is it for this place. So I've just pretty much emptied most of the input stuff from the dump box into the main sort of construction box. We now have 19 large optronic bridges. I mean, we have, sorry, large optronic matrices. We have no large optronic bridges, uh, but we could probably make some. We have 48 of the required, whatchamacallits here, of these for our thing. Not quite sure what's going on outside, with lots of banging on the doors. Um, but we have 48 of those, which would actually do our entire ship that I want to build. So I'm going to get things together here and start getting that one ready. And I'm probably going to check it. I was relatively happy with it before. I'm going to check. CPU tiers are locked. Tier 1. Now that's fine. That's as it's supposed to be. So if we add this to factory, I can now add all of those. And I need... Oh, I need 12 small electronic matrices. That I don't actually have. But I could probably make some. And then that would leave the cores I've got for me to add to the short hop or something as a mining ship. Or even start looking at a completely different mining ship. We also need some platinum, which we had platinum, didn't we? We had lots of platinum. Yes, we've got like 240 of plat platinum. We only need 15. So we can grab that. We can grab, we, it's going to chew through a lot of our Erestrum and Zoscosium, I'm afraid. Um, probably quite a bit of some of our other resources as well but we should be able to actually get this to a point where we can bring it in I mean it needs like 2,000 copper ingots so let's chuck those in what's that oh I'm, I'm dying of hunger hold on a second hold on a second don't die don't die don't die thank you much better mmm tasty my starvation is uh, not doing me a lot of good here. Right, eat the sandwiches, Sev. Eat the sandwiches, they're crap. You don't actually need to keep them. We'll just eat those kind of bits in the background. Right, so back onto this. Right, that is enough of that. Carbon substrate. <laughs> not so easy to get enough of. Well, I see that. I've probably got enough. Right, let's have... Let's just chuck 300 and that'll be fine. Neodymium. We need 1,300. There you go. Done. Iron. We only need like 1,000 iron. So there we go. 1,000 iron. Done. Erestrum we need 1,000. Which is actually quite a lot of our supply so that is gonna suck a bit even that's actually not quite gonna be enough we need another what nine yeah that's chewing through our supply a bit and zascosium exactly the same so let's just chuck that in we split the rest of this down to be enough. There we go. That should be one over what we need. 
titanium, not got that on me, cesium, aluminium powder, and platinum. So yeah, definitely going to need, what I could just do is chuck one of the things in there, but then I've, then I've wasted those bridges. So I want to try and make these optronic matrices and see if we can get this to the point we need it. So that maybe next episode, we might be able to bring it in if it's ready. So let me see if I can sort those bits out. Okay, so we're producing the matrices. Uh, he says, he says, if I bring it up, we are producing the matrices. We've already made two. We're well on our way to making the others. However, in a shock to no one, what we're short of is oh, I actually have oh no it's, it's making the last one uh, yeah in a shock to no one what we're going to be short of is carbon substrate what an a-hole um, so that's annoying one other thing I'm probably going to do while I think about it as well is I think we had no, that was for thrusters back there, and that's for thrusters there. But I think somewhere, like, up here, somewhere I'm going to tuck in another um, advanced generator, because we could really do with one. I've noticed we've come very close to maxing out at certain times. Um, we're not quite... Well, I've seen it get to 101. So we are technically maxing out, um, only just. But if I do much else with the ship, I'm, I'm gonna need more. Wow, okay, this is an advanced, advanced generator. This is the big, big bugger. That's not, that's not the one I'm talking about. Okay, that's the gigantic one. Okay, I don't want one of those. I want one of these, a large generator. Oh, it's three. Oh, that's that's a pain. Um. Okay. So I'll have to find a spot for that because I need to chuck another one of these in. Even if, <coughs> even if it's just on the roof up here somewhere out the way. And I move this over and make another doobie firkin here. I mean, I could actually get rid of one here and just put a spare generator up there. But, um, yeah, I need to tuck one in here somewhere. Even if it means, like, perhaps I'll take one of these blocks out, put it in somewhere. I think I'm gonna need to tuck one in. Okay, I'll look at that, I think, another time, off camera. In the meantime, now we have got rid of this base. That leaves us one other heat sink to look at now before we sort of move on. And I want to go and check what that is out so I know for next time. So we're going to go and have a look at that while the optronic bridges are making. And maybe we'll be able to... I haven't seen any trees. We can certainly get some stone here. To make some carbon substrate. Okay, change of plan. We're making it down to that next episode, but it has come to my attention. There is something I have. Uh, I keep thinking I need, which, uh, if I go to this box right here, this is the dump box. This box is full of goodies that I probably. Well, in fact, so is the output constructor output full of stuff that ultimately I probably need to deconstruct a bunch of. Now, I'll need to sort these around to get them into a state where I can deconstruct them and I'll probably actually end up using one of these or something temporarily to stick it in or something like that. However, one way or another, I need some deconstruction. Now, I had a feeling that was only base, but then it did occur to me that there was, um, I had a feeling Reforged Eden might have actually, um, 
we need to turn the shields off. There we go. Um, that Reforged Eden might have actually done something with that and changed things around. And it has. So, Reforged Eden makes it possible to have a deconstructor on your CV. Which seems quite useful to me. So, we need to try and make one of these. We can have a deconstructor and it can be added to your capital vessel. So that seems like something that would be highly useful. Along with the ability then to deconstruct a bunch of these parts, which would actually give me probably quite a bit of carbon substrate to spare. I mean, we can obviously chuck this now into, into here. But there's a good chance, I'm not sure if it will break it down as far as carbon substrate, but it would mean that quite a lot of this can be broken back down. A lot of the stuff I'm not so interested in using. Like multiple rocket launcher, definitely interested in keeping that. Um, you know, and some of these turrets and things, maybe not the base ones, but some of these can be broken down and some of these cannot be in terms of what I would like to happen. And even like breaking down maybe some of these hover bikes, I'm not sure if we, we can, but some of these can definitely be broken down into goodies and the like. So I think that's something we want to get done. So let's get one of these in here. You can go there. So I'm guessing my deconstructor will take up all of that space. And now we're going to go here and we'll re figure out, figure all those and we'll go the construction. So anything we want for deconstruction can now be there. So like that land cake plane device, a uh, bunch of those, probably some of these medium fuel tanks, this, this, this. This, 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 and all go for deconstruction. These can go, these can go, these can go. Uh, probably gats. Not too worried about gats. In fact, laser cannons, because all of that is going on the other thing. Yes, I'm warm. I'm stood right by a generator. That's probably not the best plan. Um, but yeah, there's lots of stuff now I can chuck in for deconstruction. And that will actually help me out quite a bit. Where are you? Deconstruction. I don't know if I can deconstruct those, but we'll put a bunch of it in for deconstruction. Um, these advanced medium thrusters, not really interesting. Light shield generator. Not really interested in that one those yes yeah so a bunch of this stuff can be put down for deconstruction so the panels I'll take here as our deconstructor right there and that volume is full already and then I can just deconstruct that straight into the input tank oh that's a funky looking thing these days isn't it and there it is. I mean, it makes it a bit more bare here than I would probably like it to be. But, um, you know, I'm fine with that. Once we put some engines in there, it'll be fine. And you, sir, you can go from the deconstruction and you can output to construct your input. And please do your thing. And there you go. It's off. It's off and underway. I'm not sure what that was, I just deconstructed, but whatever it was, it was relatively valuable. So, that's going to be that, that going, and next time we're going to go down and see what that POI was, because I don't know whether that was just an artifact or whether that's an abandoned something else, and we'll take that one out as well whatever it is, and move on down to see if there's anything else worth grabbing. 
But in the meantime, I'm going to say thank you very much for watching, like and subscribe as always, and join us again next time. Thanks a lot.